Hello and welcome. My name is Mikael Rajap and I have a wonderful individual with me today. We had a bit of a conversation and I thought I need to uh, share the knowledge that this uh, guy has said, uh, or what we spoke about. Uh, let me ask him to introduce himself firstly and then we'll get into the conversation that we'll have. Hi. My name is Brother Randall. I'm uh, a boarder is in Enewa Park. Can I speak Afrikaans? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, I play in Enewa Park, I play in the streets, but I don't get to the ghetto, the back streets and so on. And uh, uh, I have to say that I have to say that I have to in my time, okay? I can not get out. I can not get out. I can not get out. Yeah, and uh, all the people actually that was um, doing different things, I was like part-time in Walker, I'm mostly in the back line. Okay. Because I don't want to be seen. You say backline? Backline means it's like I support the whole movement, but I push it forward without everybody knowing. Okay. Otherwise, people show a finger to you. Yes. Okay. So in other words, you're like undercover with the movement of all things that is wrong. Okay. So Implementing gay terrorism, yeah. uh, move forward. Even I had to uh, run my own gang called the Naughty Boys. Okay. And uh, but at the olden of the day, that time the Americans actually uh, fight the naughty boys yeah. at that time, you know. Okay. And there was like stabbing two people. They're bringing me in another naughty boy cafeteria. They call him Afi. Yeah. He's also a 26 bender. And uh, that time, it was like I had to go because I had my own Sabine. Uh, like that time with the bookies. The bookies? Yeah, I know the bookies. I've never heard of the bookies. Serious? Yeah, serious. I, honestly. Inform me. So you don't know about the uh, Hardy Boys? You don't know about Genuine TV Kids? No. You don't know about... Are uh, these the gangs? That English? was the gangs of my time. Okay. You understand? Okay. With the Sexy Boys, Mongrels. Yes, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Scorpions yeah. and all that. Yes. So, actually in our young life, right, we had all this movement. I actually put a hand from my own chest because... Um, I think if I see it now in, the, in, in this picture, in this lifetime, yeah. how we was part to corrupt everything. Mm. Understand? Yeah. With the inflammation. We are the people that like, uh, let other families be break down. You understand what yeah. I mean? Yeah. Their children cry around them and then drinking. They, they go around and do their thing, you know? Yeah. And the children are always so, in the back line, we saw all that, but we was only thinking about money. Of course. Yeah. You understand? Because... It comes to survival of the fittest. But all that happened now recently, about two years ago. Yeah. Uh, same about three years ago. Yeah. I learned about the uh, Khoisan, yeah. the Bushmen. Okay. You understand? They call it indigenous people, right? So this part of the empire that we are underneath, I'm actually, I'm going to tell you, okay. They appoint me to be the police of the empire. Understand? Yeah. And we recently had a meeting with our Empress, Empress Valerie Lecce Sabina the third. Yeah. The granddaughter of Moses uh, Moses, the first King Moses Moses. The yeah. first. Yes, he was the king of Southern Africa. Wow. The whole Africa. So our DNA runs back. Of course. Yeah. Right? Our DNA runs back. So the colonizer came and colonized everything, right? Yeah. So they found out there's a lot of minerals, there's a lot of richness. And South Africa is the land of honey and milk. Mm -hmm. You understand what I mean? Southern Africa and all that. Okay, there's a Bantu, there's a Nguni. Yeah. They all were came with a colonizer. You understand? And that time, they were fighting the Bushmen for their lands. Yeah. They depressed them, they killed them, right? Yeah. Now, all colored people now, the DNA runs back to King Moses the first. Yeah. Understand? Now his our granddaughter is claiming Southern Africa back, but the indigenous way. Nice. Right? Yeah. So indigenous is first nation of Southern Africa. Okay. But nobody wants to give recognition because they know. Mm. You understand? Yeah. And you think maybe that uh, the... When you say that you're talking about the colonizers, the British... The British uh, is the colonizer. Yeah. America, same, because... Yeah. South Africa is like a stock market. Mm. All business is running from here. Yeah. You know that I have learned also that uh, the, the Cape, 
This was the safe route for transporting on ships, everything. This was the route they came, the mm -hmm. coastline came. Yeah. You know, all the way to the coastline, you reach everywhere in Southern Africa. Yeah. Right? So the Northern Cape, diamonds. Yeah. Right? Kimberley, diamonds. Mm. In between there's gold. Yeah. Right? Who, who's taking it over? The beers. Right? The beers is who? Not us. Britain, yeah. right? Yeah. You get you get Germany have a say in here, right? All big companies have a say in here. Yeah. You know, they're running actually the shop. If you drive by Woodstock, you shall see that, uh, you know that thing that Mandela was sitting in? That, that cloak yes, with yes, the yes, mark yes, here, yes, the, yes. The, the England mark? Yeah. Oh my God. So, there it comes in. They own. You see the statue in the parliament? Yes. Did you see uh, Somerset? Seen the Somerset, you shall see all the pictures are all there, all the old Somerset, all, those. all the pictures of the colonizers, everybody, you know, yeah. and so we are now the people who sees everything what they do, yeah. they did bring everything in, like I said, they put a bag of drugs there, Yeah. they choose five people out, this is literally what happened, this is literally what happened, they call it like, some is 28, some is 27, some is 26. Yeah. They are running all this, and some of them have been chosen out who can bring forward a big gang. Okay. You understand? Okay. So if you bring forward a big gang, then everybody changes. There are you, yeah, I am. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. So we have to fight each other for that money. So the focus is, according to that, is to take you away from what they're doing. Yeah. You see uh, that, that uh, king was here of, what's his name, Harry? Okay, yes, yes. That King Harry? Yeah. What do you think we're coming to do here? Do you remember the last time they did get a big diamond? Yes, yes, yes. Right? So what do you think they're doing here again? They're scanning the area, they keep it, they keep us like we help you. They give a few... To the media. Yeah, they, they give a few people about, I think... Correction is about uh, one million pounds yeah. to win, yeah. right? Who is that individual people? The people who already have, but our flexes is like, it's like going down, brother. Yeah, that's true. They don't care anymore of Inova Park or Mitchell's Plain, Bontivo, all these places because they evict the people according to the law. Yeah. But that law has been run by the colonizer. Yeah. Right? So you as a Southern Africa, how is it possible that you must be run with the other country's law. Yeah. But the wages up there, the pension fund up there, the disability fund up there, is thrice more than your money you earn here. Yeah. yeah. No, it's not the political, right? <laughs> yeah. You understand yeah. what I mean? So we are now the independent, so-called colored people. Yeah. Indigenous people. Yeah. Uh, we stand together. Yes, the, 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 our emperor said we mustn't use uh, Khoisan anymore because it's also the name that the colonizer gave That's, because they didn't have a okay. name, right? And it goes to the clique. They say Khoi Kam. Yeah. Understand? And she said that is also not... But so okay. What would, the, what would be the term then? The term is indigenous people. Indigenous people. First okay. nation. Yeah. Right? Okay. When it comes to first nation, it is an independent so-called colored people because... Your was put 946 in a bracket. Yeah. Colored white and black. Yeah. Right? So if they put you in a bracket, what do you think will happen? You are a race. Mm. Of what? Of the pawn, what they are busy with. Yeah. So when they want to bomb up, if they say colored, they know colored. Okay. All around the world, colonizers, if they say colored, yeah. they bomb colored. They know exactly which color it is. Okay. That's why they mark your houses, they mark your roofs with numbers, everything. They say they make their work easier, but yeah. what about the satellites? You know why people kill like the big merchants? Why? why? They give them the money for a certain time and let them work. If they come by about 50, 60 million, where do you think, where will they be ending up? Above. You understand yeah. what I mean? Yeah. And nobody yeah. above goes above the colonizer. Okay. If they see then they use certain amounts of groups wow, to take you out. Geez. And this is the next group that wants it's, to get the power. That's, that's how they keep the people busy. Jeez. 
without us knowing, they're taking billions and billions of diamonds, gold, iron, everything. They strip our land. But before they can strip our land, we must stand up as the people, yeah. not the community that's yeah. governized. Yeah. People. Yeah. You yeah. When it comes to the people, we are one nation, one mm. voice. You understand mm. what I mean? Amen. When it comes to our empire, right? Our empire is an empire that moves for the people. We move for the people. Yeah. We don't move for the money. We don't move for nothing. Just remember we have nothing. Yeah. But still we stay and we are not scared. Yeah. Because we know when this move gets fruit, yeah. you plant the seed. Yes. The seed must die before it grows. You understand? Yeah. What is what? What you gonna? Uh, uh, what you gonna? Afrikaans, right? But you got say how you mouth. Yeah. So it say for also future for your kindness and my kindness for our yeah. kindness for yeah. our. Yeah. That only can get choked with and get depressed with. So always get depressed and get choked with. Mm. You understand? Yeah. So exactly America is 15 years in advance for South, South Africa. Okay. A Pentium one is like 60 years ago in America. Yeah. You understand? Yeah, and now we get Pentium 4. We are now by I, I-59, I-10. Yeah. I mean generation. Sorry, 5, 7 generation. 10 generation. But by then is a sicko already 24. And we're going to work it out. Yeah. We're going to bring it. So slow is our education here. So we mustn't move forward. Yeah. You understand what yeah. I mean? Yeah. Did education you see, is a yeah. trap. Did you see like uh, YouTube when you see in America? Child of two years old give you the your, the whole uh, uh, strategy how how many governments what is address what is surname what is everything yeah. mother's name he can announce for two people's name when yes. he's three years old. Yeah. You see how three years old walk with a gun. If the That's cops come they past, yeah. they shoot the cops with their fingers. That's what they're learning us. So in other words, the colonizer is here just to corrupt us. Yeah, man, I see it and I feel it. In 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 in, in the um, well, in the field that we work with drug addiction, like I do honestly feel like it's a. I've never said this before, but this is how I feel, and I see now why, like it's a losing battle. Um, the addiction, the gangsterism, it's growing ten times faster than what the little organizations that are there that's actually trying to make a difference in the our, like you mm -hmm. say, the communities. Um, yeah, man, and thank you for letting me know or letting us know about that. Um, it makes a lot more sense. And do you think there is a way around it that we can actually make a difference? So whether it's be getting in contact with you guys, how do we work together, make the movement bigger? Um, because I think as a people, that is what we actually need. Yeah. Okay, to do that is you uh, Google Aboriginal. Yeah. Right, they will give you group six. Or you take my phone number. Okay, which is? Uh, it's like my phone number is, um, wa um, sorry, 067? Yeah. 868-1593. Uh, okay. Is it right? Yeah. Then you add me on your WhatsApp. You know, I'm not so good in okay. my business adding and so on. Yeah. And then I send you the, the link of the group. Yes. Right? Group 6. Yeah. There's a, a other admin. Aboriginal indigenous person, yes. uh, sovereignty, yeah. and autonomous person. Yeah. It means free, independent colored people. Nice. You understand what I mean? Nice. Yeah. And we are the nation who will take everything over. And we shall change everything, not the way the colonizer taught us, not the way our school taught us, completely what we actually are. Yeah. The cleverest per people on this bloody planet in Southern Africa. No one could have won, won the wars if it wasn't for colored people. Mm. You understand what I mean? All wars were fighting. Yeah. All police. We were the bodies. Definitely. The ground, yeah. Yes. We were the bulletproof vest. Yeah. You understand? Even, look, here, in the time of the apartheid, the people were fighting. In the time of the independency, uh, 1994. Yeah. Right? So Mandela is supposed to be come out. What do you think what happened there? Did he come to his people and say I'm out? He went to the Oppenheimers. Yeah. He went to Britain yeah. to the yeah. emblem. And people don't know this. And they're busy going on, tweeting. Yeah, yeah, but this is a kicker. Yeah. 
the kicker is when I want to uh, tell actually the media and all the people and even you. Which is? Your barcode of your ID is a trust fund. Yeah. The you government need? owes you a lot of money. Since you are Aboriginal First Nation, autonomous person in the region of our empire, underneath our Empress Valerie Lecce Which is in South Africa? Southern Africa and the whole Africa. Okay, okay. You understand yeah. what I mean? Even yeah. Ethiopia, yeah. even all African countries yes, yes, yes. belongs to the empire. Okay. So the empire moved to get it back. Yeah. But the government don't give us recognition they for won't. that. Yeah. Because they gave us only a stamp of a social development movement. Mm. And this is the same like this. Yeah. They run like this. Yeah. And for the movement for the drug industry or the people who work against drugs, don't go kill your own people. Don't go kill the merchant and the gangster because they are out education. They mm. only know survival. Yeah. Right? Yeah. If you wake up a dog, what is the dog going to do when it's a bloody pit bull or a rottweiler? Even a yeah. snake, yeah. what is going to do? Going to bite if it's yeah. a survival, right? Yeah. But the same thing with the drugs. Yeah. The same thing with the people. The same thing with gangsters. Sure. They got nothing to do. They are not educated enough to move forward. The only education they know is the school education. Yeah. But they don't know the indigenous need. Yeah. Yes, they don't know the indis uh, uh, indigenousness yeah. of their sovereignty yeah. and autonomy that they have. Yeah. They are an empire on their own. The minerals of, this, uh, of Southern Africa, everything belongs to us. The colonizer came and take it and colonize everything. Yeah. They, 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 they don't care if they break your neck or kill your baby. Yeah. Just as long as they stay on top. Yeah. You understand? They run the show. Yeah. Is, 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 is there a way that you can think or that you guys have in plan in the future? How would this be? Uh, how would this be dealt with? How do you overthrow something as big as this that's been coming on for years? I mean, is that part of the plan as well? Okay. For 30 years, our emperors and Dr. Ege are fighting according to the knowledge. Yeah. And they come up with the knowledge that we are the first nation yes. according to uh, the bloodline that we have inside yeah right it runs back to a lot of ages yeah so they find out also that the country is a corporate okay. it's a business the yeah. whole country is a business and inside that business the day you were born the mother didn't know the first birth certificate she signed right mm -hmm. she signs her right away to be a straw man you are part of the system. You're part of the system. Yeah. Now they make a copy of it and they take it to the stock market. And you're part of the market too. Mm. And why the, the police and everybody and law enforcement is all that? They don't protect and serve us. They protect the business. Mm. They protect the business. To keep you in place. If they would have protected us, why do you have to go comb procedures through to make a business? To survive. Yeah. Why they come in radio house? Because I'm not talking about drugs now. I'm not yeah. talking about uh, anything that break down our people. Yeah. I'm talking about people who want to work and educate our people how to do that business according to that business okay. and to make millions, not peanuts and thousands and in no. hundreds. No, I'm talking about millions. Yeah. What are we going to and work? Yes. But are we going to work for millions? Yeah. They put the law on it. What, 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 okay, I have learned by our emperors and Dr. Edgar and the administration and everybody that helps me. Yeah. Right? Educate me on the phone all the time. Do you see, yeah? No. Yeah, for no. law? Lane. No, I'm not sure. But yeah, is for lane. Okay. Right? Yeah. L is for A. Okay. W is for water and C. So everything you touch there is law. Yeah. You understand yeah. now? Yeah. So yeah. they put the law on us. In front of our forehead, in front of our chest. That's what it is. So now you know Southern Africa belongs to so-called colored people according to our ancestral rights. Yes. King of the first. And now we're under the empire of our Empress Lexi Sabina, Valerie the Third, and Dr. Edgar then. Yeah. They are fighting for us. They are fighting for our children. They are fighting to get all this uh, corruption of the road yeah. and everything. You yeah. understand? Yeah. The only thing that drugs come in, gangsterism be um, enforced, 
is so that the colonizers, the colonizers so move forward and keeps us, keep us down. They yeah. use the security to keep us down. Yeah. The security is the SFPCEPs, yeah. the courts, yeah. the lawyers. Everybody has one corporation on their own and they protect the business of the colonizer. Yeah. So without being in a mindset of what you guys represent, you're basically fighting a losing battle. That's the way I see it. Okay. Yeah. Um, I mean, what can you do against something that is that big, that uh, we, we were looking at it, like you said, and uh, the business South Africa, mm. an organization, and it's been coming on for years, but the people are waking up, and I, I believe there's a lot of other organizations out there, I call it organizations, but like us, that, uh, that, that tries to assist our people, uh, that is on drugs, that is busy with gangsterism. Um, however, you need to step it up a, a, a notch higher and understand there's a consciousness to this and, and, and connect with those type of people such as yourself um, so that they can actually be, you can make a difference. Um, yeah, man, it, it's, it's really nice to have met you and to, to, go, to get into this conversation about yes. the current reality yes. and change is going to come. I believe yes. that. That's why even your business that you run, yeah. right? Everybody makes a buck out of it. Yeah. Because you cannot afford to run it on your own. No. Yeah. You have to have people on that system, on the substance, so the family can pay the bill exactly. for the other person. That's the you understand? That I don't because care. that is the food, that is everything. Yeah. Does the the, the you are a non government organization, yeah. right? NGOs, yeah. right? Why they choose you as NGOs? Why, Why don't they just give you a ten million? They are about to, they are about to give China six billion to build a road. Why did they just give you ten million? Yeah. Have a Mursa building, forgive me, Lord. Have a Mursa building. Yeah. Accommodate people, give them work, let them live, exactly. let them breed the different ears what they breed. Yeah. We use people that have these businesses. Yeah. You can actually lock them up. Yeah. Even for a year. You will be so able to support them for food, medicine, everything. Where's the people that actually give the sponsors? Who's the people? The colonizer. Yeah, yeah. And how do they give the sponsors? Yeah. Hey, that's what I'm talking about, yeah. bro. Yeah. I mean, come on. That's what I'm talking about. That's why you cannot move forward. Exactly. You have to have this campaign. Yes, you have to have this campaign. Yeah. You have to run everything. They yeah. know exactly. This is only something to close your eyes further. Yeah. They put a curtain in front of you. Yeah. And that curtain is their movement according to what they know. Just to take you as you are, yeah. me, a straw man, but I'm not a straw man anymore. Yeah. Thank God for it. Yeah. And they move you like a puppet. If they say campaign, if they say that, yeah. Then you run. Yeah. But when they have one, what do they do? What do they do? When they have one. Yes, what do they do? I'm not too sure. Either. They don't care at all just as long as their house survives. Okay. They don't care. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah. You see, there was a other lady of Menemberg. Uh, there's Fanza. Um, there's Gudup. They call themselves Koisans, right? Yeah. And then you get the, the chiefs and the kings, they call themselves Khoisans, right? Yeah. Why did they move into the Khoisans nice then? But they know they are free indigenous people and Southern Africa belongs to them. It was for a 1400 bucky and it was for a stipend. <laughs> they stabbed my two-year-old child in the back. That's what they did. Yeah. Once you accept the colonizers' way, what do you think you do with your child that is not born yet? So born. Yeah. You understand yeah. what I mean? Yeah. So I'm gonna tell you something. In the Bible it said the Lord said, I'm the Noah of the heart and what is this he called kidneys. Yeah. So everything that is to do with medicine, where does it start when you get old to give in? Your heart and your kidneys. Yeah. So if you keep this clean, how can you use the medicine? Mm. You understand what I mean? Yeah. Is everything is a business, everything is a cooperation, everything is about survival. But we as the indigenous people, first owners of Southern Africa, we must rise to move forward and put our fist in the air and say, Amma, sir, we are done with all your lies and your manipulation. Mm. We're going to move forward. We're going to kill drugs. We're going to kill gangsterism. We're going to do everything. 
You understand what I mean? Yeah. By the movement of so-called colored independent Cape Malays and all colored people. You understand what I mean? Thank you, brother. Thank you so much. Yeah. Thank you. You can Thank you. what you want to do. Awesome. No, that was, that was quite. Yeah.